An overcast fall Saturday in Providence, Rhode Island, and Brown Stadium is the setting for today's college football matchup between the Brown Bears and the Blue Devils. Level that go for it more on fourth down than James Perry and the Bears. Wilcox to pass on first down. Fires deep to Rocket, and he has him complete down to the five-yard line. Once again, it's the two captains to each other, and Wes Rocket just shows extending his body there, as you saw. What an athletic play over the shoulder, and Wilcox sees him, and he makes a great diving catch. Right here, it looks like Lucier will take the snap. He does. Fakes the handoff. He's going to throw, and it's an easy touchdown for the Bears. Complete to Mark Mahoney in the end zone, and the Bears take a 6-0 lead. John, that's the first time this season the Bears have thrown out of the Kodiak package. Not easy in this type of turf right here. It's a little bit wet, and he does a nice job of just wrapping him up. Good technique and throwing it to the right spots, even if it's a miss. On second down and 10 from the 11, Wilcox to pass again. Fires end zone, caught. Graham Walker, touchdown. Graham Walker does a great job right there of cutting it into the middle right there. And Connecticut gets caught in his zone coverage and they don't come over to get him. But Walker, the senior, picks up a big touchdown. First touchdown catch of the season for the senior wide receiver from Heinsburg, Vermont. Ortega. Gives it to Thomas once again, and he's going to be brought down to the backfield. Tackle for a loss on the play by the Bears, number eight, Terrence Lane. Terrence Lane did a nice job he, from the right side and just kind of drove down the line. And it's Isaiah Gamble who comes up with the, really, the tackle that kind of saves it right there and does a good job. Percent completion percentage through the first two games, and more importantly, He's not turning the ball over. This time he hits Mahoney on the little wide receiver slip screen for the first down inside the 30. But I, I just love the way that Jake Wilcox has played this year. Percent completion percentage through the first two games. And more importantly, he's not turning the ball over. This time he hits Mahoney on the little wide receiver slip screen for the first down inside the 30. But I, I just love the way that Jake Wilcox has played this year. Yeah, and I love the way it's even when there's misses. He's positioning the football for incomplete passes so it does not get intercepted. Right. Wilcox to pass on first down. Fires it to the end zone for Walker. It is caught. Touchdown, Bears. What a catch by Walker. Had a coverage all over him. And he's able to pull that down. And he's done that all season with coverage on top of him. Great concentration. Take the handoff. Wilcox back to pass. Looking to the end zone. Caught. Touchdown, Wes Rocket. That was all Wes Rocket right there because Wilcox glued right in on him when you watch this develop right here. And he takes the cornerback to the back corner and then cuts it to the inside for the touchdown. Experienced route right there by an experienced player. Third touchdown catch of the season for Wes Rocket, the fifth-year senior from Marblehead, Massachusetts. Snap to Ortega. It's a quarterback draw, and he takes it up and is tripped oh. up short of the 20-yard line. Good open field tackle made there by Cooper DeVoe. That's a great job by Cooper DeVoe. I love that play right there by DeVoe. He just comes up and sacrifices his body and just dies for the feet and does a great job of wrapping up the quarterback right there. Brings up a fourth down. Wilcox to pass, fires middle, wide open Rocket, 25 yard line, 20, and there goes Rocket at the 15, 10, 5, and he's tackled at the one yard line. <clears throat> Great job by Wes Rocket. We said he's a leader in the FCS at wide receiver, and he's just adding on the stats after that big catch. DeLucia gets the handoff straight ahead into the end zone, touchdown Bears. Great job by DeLucia off the left side right there. Gets up inside, and the big guys for Brown open up the hole, and they answer Central Connecticut with their own touchdown. Boy, and a quick answer it was by the Brown offense. Let's take another look at that long pass to Rocket he and the great run after the catch. And he gets in between the cornerback and the safety right there, as you can see, and he's able to find that seam. And here's the touchdown run by DeLucia. That's just right over the top right there. Good blocking up front. Wilcox dumps it off to Miller. And Miller with some running room. And he could go 
at the 30, 25, 20, 15, 10, 5, touchdown, Solomon Miller. Solomon Miller shows tremendous speed. It was set up by Wilcox on a nice fake. And he just gets it out to the sophomore wide receiver who just turns the Jets on. Ortega, back to pass, being pressured, rolling to his right, gets rid of it, intercepted by the Bears. It's Ethan or Aubrey Parker. Parker at the 15-yard line, tackled from behind. Second interception of the season for Aubrey Parker. Parker had a big interception at Bryant a couple of weeks ago, and he comes back with another one right here. Huge turnover by this defense that seems to be able to create a turnover on every game they've played in here so far this season. But Parker does a nice job of reading that pass. Puts this offense in a great spot to pile on some more points. That is the first turnover by either team. As you see, under pressure was Ortega. He gets rid of it. And Parker was the man that comes up with the interception. And great pressure being applied Mike. there by Mike Renoy. Right. And that'll do it. They will not have to snap the football again. Impressive performance in the home opener for the Brown Bears here today.